Welcome back to the Bug Eye Build. In this episode, the engine goes up on the stand for inspection and cleaning, and we discover that working on old cars is sometimes not all it's cracked up to be. Well, while I'm waiting for transmission parts, I'm going to clean off the back here, uh, get all the old gasket off. Uh, I've already got some of it off here and uh, get it all cleaned up and then so I can mount it up on the engine stand and clean up the rest of it. I had to make one repair as I uh, left a whole bunch of th threads behind when taking one of the flywheel bolts out. So there's a new flywheel bolt coming and uh, so clean that up and it works quite nicely. So well, one of my goals for today was to get uh, this mounting face all cleaned up. That's where the uh, back plate mounts. Uh, a 60 year old gasket that has been undisturbed uh, for that amount of time. Uh, took a bit of time to uh, pull off. The product I used along with a good scraper was uh, uh, this CRC gasket clean that works really well on this kind of stuff. And as an aside, it works really well on cleaning piston tops as well. I've used that uh, on another project. Um, also, got the uh, the back plate all cleaned up. That's the face that goes against the engine. And then I'll flip that around, and that's the face that goes against uh, the transmission. And uh, this covers up the oil pump that mounts in that big hole right there. The only issue I have, and uh, I don't know if it'll show up here or not, but there is a crack that runs there and then across. You can't really see it, but there is a crack. It runs all the way over to, to right about there. Uh, so I'm going to probably end up having to weld that up. It's uh, doesn't appear bad and there's no broken pieces or anything missing off the the cover so other than that uh, we're in good shape well now that the back of the engine is cleaned of that 60 year old gasket uh, next task is to mount this piece on there so we can get the whole thing up on the engine stand so uh, put the the camera down and get to work. There we go, engine's in place uh, where I want to work on it. I have a uh, oil absorbent mat mount underneath, catch all uh, the drips in that when we start cleaning. I've learned from experience that uh, it does make rather a mess. I mentioned earlier in the video I discovered a crack in the back plate. Now this is the face that mounts to the transmission and you can see here, I think, there we go, a uh, crack running from there uh, over to the bolt hole and over to where the, the starter comes through. The plan is um, 
going to widen this out into a little V and then uh, get the MIG welder out, weld that up, grind it back down, and uh, that will fix that. While we're on the subject of cracks, there's also a crack in the front mounting plate where the uh, generator mounting, one of the generator mounting bolts goes through, and you can see that it's been, an attempt has been made at repairing it, well, and that, and the weld has broken. And that, so that'll have to be fixed. I'll, I'll basically cut that one off, weld in a piece, drill a new hole, and pick up a new uh, uh, pillar bolt for the generator. Well, that does it for this video. Please be sure to like and subscribe, and hit that bell icon so that you get notified when the next video is posted. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.